Hello, hi. I'm uh, you can do everything. Durga Pediready. I'm in uh, Photo Nation product management team, looking after some of the computational, computer vision, computational photography products from uh, biometrics and then you know, Hudson detection aspects. So here now we are going to show one of the latest uh, uh, products that we have. It actually gives you a good balance or the blend between hardware and software implementation that can be done. So these are some of the image processing blocks that usually are done on the software on a DSP core or an ARM core or a graphics core. But it, uh, there are a lot of challenges to that. On an ARM core, it cannot run well. But on a graphics core, it can run fast, but the problem is with the power. On a DSP core, it has some limitations. Of course, there are some heterogeneous DSPs with some hardware accelerator engine, but still, you know, there are some limitations to that. So Photonation has, is trying to come up with a solution to address that market so that you can get high performance at a low power, which means it's a lower footprint. So how are we doing that? With our system experience, we're trying to have the hardware block, which is an IPU, image processing unit block, which is an RTL that can go into an S4C. And we have some software uh, applications or algorithms on top of that that actually leverages the uh, hardware component. So what we're showing here is a person detection, object detection, and it also has um, uh, geometrical distortion correction engine and the, the the face detection object detection is all done using the deep learning convolutional neural network approach so that can be trained for many objects it is just not a face it can be a pet it can be a chair uh, 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 something like a bike or some object so there are there are three big challenges we actually face in the industry one is can it actually detect at a very low light you can see now if this my colleague is going to walk back and uh, is almost dark over here and uh, you can still actually detect his whole body here and if you can almost like sit there please come down and i want to see your face you can see that even at that distance now he's almost like 20 feet and we can still see it so it is low light and then Distance wise is almost like 20 feet and, uh, and number two is the HDR. So when you are driving on the street, there is a lot of times we actually experience the, the bright light, low light and very high light activities. So this actually supports that as well. And then number three, we also talked about how easy is it actually to adapt to different objects, face versus a car versus, you know, a pet. So that can be trained. So these are the three key elements. So everything is running. This is, we call it as IPU 2.0 and uh, this product is available. And for more information, please try to visit www.photonation.com. Thank you.